ya 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 bo ROIP Gibini a very successful Zimbabwe millionaire Gimbini suddenly lost his life few hours after he posted he was going to pop champagne. A week before he died, he suddenly bought a coffin and put, put it in one of the bedrooms in his luxurious palatial mansion in Zimbabwe. His car, the Rolls Royce that he was seen saying he was going to pop champagne, a, a beautiful and purple silver and white rose rose which you can see he's sitting on was burnt and crushed to a cinder here is a video of a truck taking away the debris of this rose rose here he is his body being put in a police casket it is so sad that this young man a 36 year old successful businessman with a lot of businesses chains to his name he started his business at the tender age of 17 and he has been so successful he was with his friend gabriel amoli better known as babe moella you can see her here in the photo shoot she took to celebrate her just before she celebrated her 26th birthday herself and another gentleman from a Southern African country and a lady from Malawi, they all died and lost. They lost their lives in that unfortunate, ghastly motor accident. Here is a picture of his Rolls Royce. The same Rolls Royce, that purple Rolls Royce you see him in. These are the bodies taken away in a, an ambulance to the mortuary. Moments, you can see him here, you know saying he was going to pop champagne they are going to pop champagne all night and they actually went to pop champagne to celebrate the 26th birthday celebration of moena a fitness motivational inspirational lady who's been influencing a lot of young girls here is the caption of the party in the nightclub that's moena That is Gibini on the floor, dead, in the same shirt you saw him wore while he made that video. Unfortunately, they all died. One of the gentlemen who died in along with the, the others in, in this Rolls Royce had committed um, a crime in his country and he was being look they were looking for him in his country, but he was in Zimbabwe and he died in that accident he was wanted in his country for a crime that he committed moena was only 26 year old and according to what her father has said he's a humble man he said he hadn't seen his daughter since early uh, in the year of 2019 so he hasn't seen his daughter for a long time and that he was very very worried about the, her lifestyle or the sort of lifestyle that she was living he particularly said that he was worried about uh, her parting ways that his daughter chose to live he was really really worried about that so he hadn't seen his daughter unfortunately this is the news that they have got according to sources make i switch to my pigeon english they go celebrate this girl 26th birthday so and when they go celebrate the birthday they go celebrate the birthday for one of the nightclub when he gets the man they're very successful he get money where where this uh bbc carry and say the, he was worth up to 50 to between 50 to 76 million pounds not be euros or pounds say the guy was very very successful he started a business at the age of 17 and in fact in that zimbabwe according to report they say he get a lot of enemies as well as a lot of fans and and my areas. so they go this party they call the pop sham pain after the party when they come back they say they drive and then he tried to over or over he tried to overtake the the one truck when he day in front so as he tried to overtake a taker now so the guy hit a honda fit car and the honda fits now on america when we say everybody they buy he tried to 
hit that one. So now there, he, he, maybe he lose control. The car, on that full speed, he go hit tree. As he hit tree, in the car, in bounce out of the car, hit the floor. Honestly, so according to eyewitness, when they did, they can't see fire. They, they, they're here, obviously, you know, you know, Africa, how the whole place be people run, run there, run to try and rescue. As they reach there, they can't see waiting, they go on. They try to rescue this Moena. They say, because when they reach there, she did alive. She can't they say, please help me, help me. Say, she can't they scream, see me, they help her. He say, as they, the guy say, as they try to help her, I saw the, the car burst into flame. I saw all of them run. The, the whole three of them inside that motor moena the other guy and the other girl for man all of them born to his cinder they born to ashes and you know say africa nothing like um uh, uh, uh emergency services around you know how africa be we don't need to talk while. for this video now I'll you will see me. her she they say she say me. may you listen to the video according to the video she get premonition say she would die saying that premonition say she can't cry she can't beg for happen. help you see everybody just they look and say nobody he says so she can't cry and actually the thing happened the and thing all happened. i'm left with may is the darkness of my mind but each time it seems like I sink deeper and deeper, and I'm scared, terrified that one day I won't make it back up. It feels like I'm gasping for air, screaming for help. But everyone just looks at me with confused faces. This video, she can't be crying. She can't say she get permission. She can't cry. Say she, 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 the video not too clear. What is she did talk? I try to do <laughs> everything about the uh, volume. Try to you know technical the volume to to try and you know get and make what is she did talk. They very clear. It not clear. So now that video now she did talk. She can't be prejudiced. Can't be talk. Say she see. Say she she go die. This now the scene of the accident. Go see, you see this red thing they use something to take over the man body. Go see and then I did for flow so and Africa they, they instead of them made they try to help this. I don't know, Sha. Now the car now say they born the Rolls Royce. So I beg my people, make we try as much as possible to live a life well. According to waiting this girl, Papa, the man a humble man. He said he never see Peking since early last year. Of 2018, saying they worried about the lifestyle when they live. Obviously, the guy know the kind of home when they he born in Peking, the kind of home when they come from. So, and this guy now, money enter here. They say one go pop champagne. As he enter inside that he was dressed, he no say no go come back. Now that pop, that now that the last time, the next thing we see and the car they born he day on floor with that same shirt when he wear. And for me, he go back off and put for a house, put for one of his bedroom. Now money take over his brain and been awaiting because our person go go to buy coffee, put inside the house. For me, oh, according to waiting me, I know they know they do that kind of thing. That's in a taboo for Africa. You know that kind of thing not be something when you go predict. You go go buy coffee, go go buy coffee, come put her inside one of your bedrooms for inside your house. That means I don't know. I will not say this matter. Maybe we talk now. Your favorite baby, your favorite titty, Kirsty Valentine.